Well, the federal government of Somalia has deployed more troops uh, to Gado region of uh, Jubaland, which could lead to escalation of tension between federal government and Jubaland state. Because last month we saw heavy fighting in Bola Havo town of Gado region between Somali federal government forces and uh, Jubaland regional forces backed by Kenya. Uh, now, reportedly, Turkey-trained uh, troops uh, ha have been deployed by Somali federal government uh, in the past two to three days to Gado region. Pictures have emerged showing uh, Gorgor Turkey-trained Somali troops being sent to Gado region. Uh, Somali federal government is saying that it is sending these troops uh, to help the people of Gado region because Gado region has been hit with drought and people need aid and humanitarian assistance. That is why Gorgor Turkey trained troops have been deployed. But Jubaland says that uh, federal government of Somalia is building up its military presence in uh, uh, this region, Gado region, which is part of Jubaland. Uh, whereas, uh, meanwhile, uh, other uh, developments which are uh, happening indicate that political stalemate is still there about next elections. Uh, regional states and federal government cannot resolve the dispute about how to conduct next elections. Uh, Juban President, uh, Puntan President uh, were in Mogadishu yesterday. They've been holding talks in Mogadishu uh, with uh, Somali federal government officials to resolve the deadlock about uh, next elections. But deadlock is still their viewers. And in, in, in the meanwhile, the uh, federal government of Somalia is stepping up its military presence in the disputed territory uh, of Gado region viewers. Thank you for watching.